Up and at them, lazy mingers! How's it going, everyone? I'm King Blacktooth. It's lovely to have you here back with me again. And something a little special for you again today, where I've made available in the video description below a link where you can download an audio mod for Gwent. I'm going to show you how to install that later on. It's pretty simple. But basically, a while back, we had some cards that had voices, and then they got redid. And people weren't happy with that because they, don't, they like the old voices, you know? And uh, if you're not interested, this video is not really for you, but you can have a listen if you want. And um, so specifically, we've changed Harold the Cripple from his Lazy Bastards line back into his Lazy Mingers line. We've changed Kahir, his three voices, back to his previous voices, so he sounds less like Morvran Voorhees. And while I was at it, I actually changed Emir Vaar and Marise's voice lines to some Witcher 3 voice lines, so it's actually Charles Dance's Emir now, okay? So, seven voice lines in general, I'm going to show you them now, and then I'll go on how to install them soon. Up and at them, lazy mingers! You'll sleep when you're dead! As you wish. I am no Guardian. I shall do what I must. And I advise you well. Do not disobey me. Listen to me. I rule the largest empire the world has ever known. At last, you provide a pleasant surprise. Okay, so if you want to install this mod, it's very simple. You'll download the file and extract it so you've got a folder named KVT Audio Mod MWUV2. This stands for Midwinter Update Version 2, where they took out Card Advantage Spies from Create. This is when I've created this mod, basically. So you'll open it up, and if we just make it look really big, oh yeah, good. So we've got en-us, this is the actual file that you're going to copy over, this is my modded file. But en-us underscore backup, this is just the backup of the original midwinter update version 2 file. I do suggest you make your own uh, backup as well before you install mine. And we've got a readme in case you want to uh, not listen to me and just go through this. Hopefully this is quite simple, uh, it's a very simple process, I'll show you it now. So the first thing you'll do is you've got to find your GOG Galaxy uh, directory. So mine's in a different place because of my computer layout. So yours will probably be in like C drive, program files, uh, GOG Galaxy, games, that sort of thing. Um, just have a look around for that. Now mine's here and I found Gwent. So I'll click on Gwent, then Gwent data, and then streaming assets, then asset bundles, and then audio. And then VO for voiceovers. And here we are. Okay, we've got ENUS here. So, what we'll do is I recommend making a backup folder and then copying that into it, like I have here. That's my original backup. And then all you have to do is go to my KBT mod, copy ENUS, which is my modded file, just paste it, and then replace the file. So now it's replaced. Okay, and now you can play Gwent and you'll have How to Cripple. Reverted, we'll have Kahir reverting, and we'll have Charles Dansamir. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoy it. Take care, and I'll see you again very soon.